All right, I took everything off of this. And what's really cool about this, it has a base in here. And I thought, okay, Lori did a, a mannequin um, Christmas tree. And I thought, boy, you could really do this up cool with pine going down, right? I know. I thought of that too, Nanny Dot. But we had it all worked out, who was dropping me off, who was picking me up, and now that just threw a curveball and everything, so he's not very happy. Yay! I'm so glad she liked it. Why wouldn't she? That thing was gorgeous. Yeah, so I thought you could actually fill this with lights, cover this on the front if you wanted, um, you could put a false back on here with like chicken wire and fill it all up with Christmas balls. Wouldn't that be awesome? What's your suggestion? You tell me, girlfriend. What you got going on? What you thinking? I'm listening. We're actually going to put this candle down in here. I could even if I wanted to put it up on here if I wanted. But I put this little rusty snowflake down in here. Oh, oh that would be cute. There's no halo though. There's just her head. Are you talking around here? It had a set of lights in it. But they weren't working, um, so I'm trying to get them fixed. But yes, yes, great idea. Now I got another reason to go shopping. <laughs> Let me turn this camera a little bit. There, there we go. All right, so I have this little wicker wreath. I'm going to put that in there. So I'm going to glue that to the... Um, snowflake I have in there. Yes, I get you. Good idea, miss. I love it. Because I was trying to get the light set that came with it working. Um, it was all corroded. And they say if you take a Q-tip with some baking soda and water and mix it up. You can clean off the contacts. I cleaned all the contacts off and it still wasn't working. So there's something wrong with it, but that's okay. Fairy lights are an awesome idea. <gasps> oh, thanks Vicki. All right. So I'm gluing in this little piece of styrofoam too, because I'll turn it around so you can see. That's what my candle's gonna sit in, this little styrofoam base. And it's one of those kind that when you want it to go on, it has an automatic timer in there. So you turn it on when you want it to go on, and then I think it goes for like six hours or eight hours and shuts itself off. So I thought, wouldn't that be cute in there? Just a little visual in there of something. It even has a, a burgundy star on the front of it. But I thought, wouldn't that be cute if you could just cover the back with chicken wire and then fill that with balls? Oh, okay, that was my husband. He got off tomorrow. He's not happy at all. Oh, well. All right, so I'm going to cover this styrofoam with some greenery. So I'm going to glue that around it. First, I'm going to glue this piece. Kind of cover up the base some. That, that covers it up really good. I'm 
still going country. I liked the design it came, like how it came. So I'm still going country. Okay, but there's our little and there. So there we go. We got our little candle holder in there. That looks pretty. I'm going to take the candle out because I have a feeling I'm going to be picking that up and down while I'm decorating. So I'll just take it out totally. All right. So got these picks. And I'm going to kind of put this one down that way. No, this one's already down that way. I just liked all the rustic stuff this had in it. Thought I had a third. I guess we only got five stars. Oh yeah, there it is. All right, and that one's gonna go there. Cause I'm liking the shape of this. I'm, I like how it kind of conforms to the um, angel wings. You got a part that swoops down and then you got a part that swoops up. So I'm liking that. So, now I didn't know if I wanted to put any of this on here, like a snowflake with some greenery. No, that would probably hide my candle. Well, let me see when I get the bow done. I like this ribbon. And I thought this would be pretty, too, to kind of dress it up a little. What do you think? Do you like that? What you working on, Vicki? Anything? Missy shipping wreaths. Let's see how far down I want this. I don't know, now that I get this closer. Yeah, I think that would be good. So I think what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put these two together and I'm going to wrap them. And I don't want my loops to be too big. And I'm going to do, let's see, I think I'm going to just do five loops. Thank you. So why? Right before I was ready to go on, they called, and now they just changed the time. So that threw my whole schedule off. So I got Nanny Dot coming to take care of the dogs. My husband was going to drop me off. My son was going to pick me up. So now it just put a kink in everything. So I'm not not happy about it. Although I'd rather get it done early, but now I got a cranky hubby on my hands. So fun, fun, fun. And you know, I just put it out there today on Facebook so my customers would know I'm not open and to be prepared and get their dog food, whatever they need. And once you know, it just went crazy and all the prayers and I, I don't misunderstand me. I, I don't like this. 
I appreciate the prayers and all, but that's not why I put it on there because inevitably somebody's going to forget or not see it and get stuck without dog food. So that's not why I put it out there. So now I feel crazy. <laughs> ah. It's my son's 35th birthday today. So he, my husband now realizes that he's got a 39 year old daughter, a 37 year old daughter. We have a 35 year old son and now it's like hit him. So now he, he realizes that his life is getting closer to the end. And I'm like, oh. Why can't he look at it as though his glass is half full, not half empty? So I kind of gave him a little bit of heck. <laughs> and now he's crankier than ever. So it is what it is. You know, I can't change it. It has to be done. So... Get over it. <laughs> you know, I you wonder how many people have survived COVID with their spouses. Because I'll tell you what, it's not been easy there. I just need a, a regular day, a regular break, and that doesn't happen. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I cut that one. And I don't want a green one. I'm the one that should be cranky. <laughs> we both need a good night's sleep he gets up so many times in the night I can't, I can't get a good night's sleep now I see why some couples change beds go sleep in a different room <laughs> I'm trying but it's not working <laughs> Don't misunderstand me. I love them dearly. But you can you come you get to a breaking point. It's like grow up. Right? There, I like that better. Just the one color. And He retired from the post office and he drives school bus. It's not the easiest job right now, but all my fingers are cracked open. <laughs> so true. My fingers are all cracked, so anytime I try and push something under something, oh, it hurts. Okay, I'm not going to do this. I'm just going to do that. And I did have a piece of tinsel tie up here, so I'm going to grab that. Not going to mess around anymore. Nope, 
that goes there. Oh, that goes there. I'm trying to find where that one goes. <sighs> I went and bought myself a milkshake today because I thought if I'm gonna if I'm gonna die, <laughs> I want to die with a milkshake in my belly. <laughs> so, I know that sounds stupid, but. You know how long I've been hungry for one of those. Hi, Dawn. I'll zoom in for you, baby. <laughs> We're just complaining about hubbies right now. <laughs> we got cranky ones. There we go. Now it's right. All right. So maybe what I'll do, maybe I can put this on here with this too. Now I better twist it once. And it's cutting my thumb. Jeez. Going to be bleeding all over this sucker shortly. It's probably not long enough. Not long enough. So... Let's let's do it all. First, we're going to fit this where we want it. Dawn, I showed her on my um, my live yesterday. It was from my uh, my um, box. I went and paid fifteen dollars for a box, and I got everything in the box. And she was one of the things in the box. I took her apart. She had a bunch of stuff on her and. So I took her apart and I, I got a skate, um, I got a Christmas tree, and I was showing everybody how to find these bargains. Okay, starting over. How to find bargains on Facebook Marketplace. Yes. I am going to, let me think here. All right. I'm sorry, guys. My head just isn't where it should be today. I'm sorry about that. Yep, she was in there. Um, all kinds of stuff. You'll have to go back and do the replay from yesterday. You will love it. Hi, Kayla. Yep. Now, I got a bigger one. So go here, through here with the bigger one. I added this little... Um, snowflake down here, rusty snowflake, and it's sitting with a little wicker wreath on top, and then I covered that up, and I actually made myself a little candle holder there, because this candle is going to sit in there, and it's the one with the timer. Thank you for spreading the love. So, yeah. 
And, and today, for two bucks, I scored a bird cage. Isn't that awesome? So we're going to do a bird cage. Woo -woo. Yes, siree. I've been wanting to decorate a bird cage for I don't know how long. And I finally found one for two bucks. And she wanted me to meet her tomorrow. <laughs> and I'm like, tomorrow's not a good day. She said, well, I'm going to be over in Hughesville. So I explained, and she said, okay, I'll drop it off. I said, all right, I'll leave the money outside. I know, right? Saw it on Facebook Marketplace. I'm telling you all, you got to look there. There's a lot of cool stuff on there. There was a mannequin I contacted a lady about last night. I wanted her to measure it for me. Because I watched, did you watch um, Hardworking Mom Lori's uh, video last night on the master class? Yeah, isn't that sweet? Look at that. And I've been wanting to do one of these. So you're talking, M Missy, about um, putting like the fairy lights around here? Is that what you're talking about? I'm going to put the bells and one of the snowflakes in the um, bow. It was so cute. It was one of those mannequin trees. And I was thinking at the same time Kathy mentioned it, she's like, well, why couldn't you just get a mannequin and add pine to it to make it look like that? Because those things are like $135, $185. I know, right? Your little guy slept in the room with his mama last night. They've been waking me up at 4.30. So I said, okay, you're sleeping with your mama tonight. Tell me that's not big enough. What is it today? Nothing's big enough. You need a drink, and you're not allowed to have a drink. Wasn't that cool, Brenda? Yep. So I said, okay, we're going to find one. And we're going to do it different. Because I actually thought you could use... Oh, crap! I just broke the seal on that. You could actually use this as your mannequin and put pine down here and decorate it. Right? And I started doing that. And then I thought, nope, too involved. Now I just lost my candle. Well, it's got to be under there somewhere. Oh, duh. Hey, hey, hey. No, she act. They were actually in a separate pen. She slept in her in her. Uh, condo but they were loving it they were running back and forth they were so busy oh, now I put it on there backwards I think I'm gonna have to take a zip tie or wire to glue that on there we go now, yeah, let's see if we can get this to work. But I had quite a poopy mess to clean up <laughs> this morning. 
And they're spending most of the day sleeping, so I think they were spending, they spent most of the night partying. But they did good. Gonna have to behave for nanny dot tomorrow. Put this tag on first. see how that looks. I hope this wire is big enough, long enough. nice gift for someone or even if you sold this for 25 bucks you still have a whole box of stuff that you can uh, make stuff from so you've made your money back in no time because I'm going with this burgundy and primitive it 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 can stay up for Valentine's Day it could stay up at all the time I could just remove the Merry Christmas tag and it would be an all-time wreath find the wire now. There it is. I'm not sure what they're going to tell me to do. So, just have to wait and see. So, they told me to take the long weekend. That's why I posted about the store closing. So hopefully everybody is prepared that they have food for their babies. Now, I can even add some little pine cones in here too, but I didn't know if I want to add any snowflakes to the skirt. I think it looks better without, or do I make little sprays to put on the skirt? I'm thinking better without. What's your thoughts? I like this. I like that you can see that through the skirt. And I, I actually like this back here because like I said, you could cover this with chicken wire. You could throw a mess of, of uh, Christmas balls in there.
I know. What do you think? Think she's good? I know. Should I show you my box, Dawn, of what I got for 15 It's right down here. Because I can't move. That's why I tell everybody, look on Marketplace, because right now people are going through their Christmas stuff. Okay, so we got the... I know, right? Okay. This I have to fix, but this is a really old wood that they made into the shape of a Christmas tree, and then this ribbon is unraveling. So I will ditch the star and fix that up. Could put that on a on a piece of um, skewer and have that sitting up. I got little tree. Remember we had talked about putting a little tree in a crock? Look. And then you can decorate the tree. So I got that. I got this one. That I can add a, a dowel to the bottom and have it sitting up too. This has a snowman on it, cut out in it. This, we're gonna do a skate. So we're gonna take this apart and do a skate. What else? We got this little tree. We got a snowman. Or a Santa Claus snowman. Another snowman. And it came with a little grungy light to put on there. Here it is. Then this little snowman basket. You could put a gift card in there, put a bow on it, and give it as the present that has the gift card in it. Came with a W, and believe it or not, my stepdaughter's last name starts with a W. A pick. Some grungy candy canes, which I will definitely find somewhere to put those. This can always put a nice small arrangement in here. That's good. People are using, I don't know if I'll use this, but I can donate it. People are using these and making um, um, a door hanger out of it and decorating the top. Then I got this thing which we could put a nice flat arrangement in here, but look at all those balls. Look at this one. Look at how unique that one looks. <laughs> and some pine cones. She had it 25 on it, and then she reduced it to 20. And I said, would you take 15? And she said, yep. Oh, and I love this thing that. Isn't that unique? So, so yep, we got some stuff to make some stuff. You go on to Marketplace, you have to put in there that, like in mine, I was showing when I had it on, I had my computer on, you have to put in how far you'll go. And when they come up, when you search, like we searched Christmas decorations, um, you can search for resupplies, whatever you're looking for. A bunch will come up that'll say shipping, will ship. Go back into your settings or your thing on the side and put local pickup only. And because I have a 20 mile radius, I can pick up within 20 miles of the person. So, so yeah, and she was in there. So I got all that for 15. And you know I'll use it. We had talked about this, putting this in. A little crock when I did that crock. 
Um, a lot of things I can do with all that stuff. So, yes, but some great buys out there right now because people aren't having garage sales because of COVID. Um, you ask them where they meet usually and they'll tell you where they usually meet, Walmart, Mini Mart, wherever. And then um, I always tell them I'm going to be there with my four ways on. I always scope them out, and it's always nice to meet in during the day in a well-lit place. And I haven't had any problems yet. So, and like this, I got the other week for $3. And it has that beveled glass in there. This will look cute with a, a lantern swag on it and a candle in there. I love Marketplace. Right, Brenda? See? I, I questioned a lady. She has a, um, a bubblegum machine. And I saw JoJo do a bubblegum machine the other day. And I always wanted to do one of those. Yep. And I mean, I would have paid $15 for this alone because I've been wanting to do one. So I just want to, Missy suggested fairy lights for around the halos. So I'm going to get those. But look, with this back, chicken wire and you could put anything in there. Or you could use this like Lori used the mannequin last night in the master class, and you could add pine all down here, and then your lights in here. But isn't that, I mean, that's cute for a door or inside. And these are one of those candles that you turn them on when you want them to go on, and then they come on every night at the same time. It has some kind of internal um, timer. Right? Yes. Thanks, pretty. I just got to cover up the zip ties somehow. Maybe I can just cover it up with this. Da -da. She's pretty. And I've been wanting one and wanting to do one, so. And I had all these, too. I thought if you wanted, you could even just cover the whole bodice with berries. So lots of unique things. Check it out. I love this ribbon. I love this ribbon so much. Just beautiful. All right, now that they changed my time for tomorrow, I got to get myself in gear. See, I don't know. I think she kind of looks cute with that on there. <gasps> oh, I think it would depend on the color. But yeah, she would look cute. A lot of ideas. So if anybody finds one and does one, I want to see your pictures. Okay. All right. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for all the well wishes. And I'll let you know how I make out. Hopefully everything goes good. I should send the lady I bought it from a picture. <laughs>
Sometimes they're shocked. They're shocked at what you can do with it. I even had a little snowman. Could have put a snowman in there. Could have done anything. Yeah, I know. Let's just hope they got it. <laughs> That's the thing that worries me the most. Whether they're on their A game or not. That's, this needs a little pine cone in there. That's where all the problem lies. Are they on their A game? I mean, look, they told me 9.30 and I had all, everything scheduled, everything figured out, who was dropping me off, who was picking me up. And now they just changed it to 7.30, that I have to be there. So that means I have to leave here at seven. So that means I gotta get up at four. But I'll have time to catch up on my sleep <laughs> or lack thereof. All right, everyone, thank you and have a great night. Bye.